Fall is officially here and people celebrated with a sunrise and sunset viewing experience on the UMass Amherst campus. 22 News reporter Nick Antonakis breaks down the astronomy behind the autumnal equinox. It's the first day of fall, or as people at the Sun Wheel at UMass Amherst this morning called it, the autumnal equinox. That marks the astronomical change of seasons. So despite the chilly weather, people came together to watch the sunrise in an open field of strategically placed stones. The sun wheel is designed so that you can see where the sun rises and sets on special days of the year like today. Those special points on the horizon are marked by tall standing stones here at the sun wheel. So as you stand at the center of the sun wheel, you'll see the sun rising. Now it's only twice a year on the autumnal and vernal equinoxes that the sun rises directly between these tall rocks on the eastern and western side of the sun wheel. And when you see that on a day like today, you know fall is here. The exact moment that the sun will pass over the celestial equator today, or in simpler terms, the moment fall officially starts this year, is at 2.19 p.m. Over the next few months, the sun will rise more and more southeast. And that will mark the winter solstice when it reaches its extreme. And then it will start back to the north. Time to celebrate because we're going to get longer days and going to uh, start getting warmer again. And with today serving as the kickoff to fall foliage and more importantly to me, more football, we've got some time until we start thinking about the beach again. For Lane Cat, taking the time to come watch this astronomical wonder year after year is a great way to stop and recognize the beautiful cycle of the seasons. No matter what is happening in the world, that there's the sun rises and the sun sets and the moon rises and the moon sets and we're all together. If you miss the autumnal equinox, don't fret. Mark your calendars for the winter solstice on December 21st. Working for you, Nick Antonakis, 22 News.